Welcome back to Life with Feet. I want to tell you all a story that happened just a couple days ago. I travel a lot as a speaker and I happened to be at an airport lounge just relaxing in between flights and I went to get myself a cup of coffee from the machine and I noticed because the machine was almost like a mirror, I could see the people behind me and I noticed that there was a guy standing behind me patiently waiting while I went to get my coffee. And as I grabbed my coffee cup with my right foot and set it on the machine and started to press the buttons to make my cup of cappuccino, um, he was still standing there waiting and I could tell he was probably watching me a little bit. And as I finished the cup of coffee and asked Patrick to carry it away from the machine to where I was seated, he disappeared. I conclude that Probably he was uncomfortable with the fact that I was using my feet on the machine, which I'm sure happens more than more times than I can even count. People are almost disgusted with my feet sometimes. But as you know, I keep my feet very clean. In fact, my feet touch less surfaces than most hands. They're, they're pretty clean. They're kept in shoes. They're kept away from surfaces and touching doorknobs and things like that. Uh, and so for me, my feet are probably cleaner than most people's hands for the most part, I would say. This Halloween, I'm gonna test out and see how disgusted kids will be when I reach into the container with all the candy, grab it with my toes and put it into their bags. Because I think at some age, there's a point when people start to get grossed out by feet. But the younger you are, I feel like the less likely that's the case. But we'll find out here on Halloween night as I pass out the candy to the kids with my toes. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. Having fun? Yeah. Okay. Where are you? Oh, I'm gonna warn you. Okay. I'm gonna give you some chocolates, okay? Okay. I'll give you two. Because you're the first trick or treater to come to our house. There you go. Thank you. One more. Just for celebrating the first cel trick or treater. Have fun. Thank you. This might be an unwinnable battle, trying to convince the whole world that my feet are just as clean as hands, but at least I can share that message here on this channel, Life With Feet, and, and hope that you can also do the same. Share this with everyone you know, so the message can get out there. And as I always ask, please like and subscribe or go to patreon.com slash toetalks and subscribe. And please help Tisha and I get this message out there. Help us to change the world one video at a time to show the world that our disability is not what defines who we are.